Hey guys, welcome back to another raid cam. Yeah, you saw what I wrote in the title. We're going to catch cheaters. We're going to catch people breaking the rules of MTS, which you'll see in this first clip. And we'll have some fun raids and stuff. So as you see here, these guys were actually, I don't know, they must have, like, the rock drake tells you when there's a reaper nearby. So they would have just punched and punched and punched until they found that. And they might have got some juicy loot, actually. This guy, he was swinging in the wrong place at the wrong time. He rolled up on these guys accidentally. And they were on him. Tim, they are after him. They were on him like a fly on bad smell. He's done. He tried to He's run, but like him. his bloodstalk is already trying to kill him. And this is where it happens. He's trying to run, poor guy. He's done. He's done. He's, he's trying. He's done. Oh, <laughs> play, bro. <laughs> See, I laughed at it, but that's actually against the MTS rules. You can't use the structure to make yourself invulnerable. I had no idea. They reported it, and he actually got banned. So you got to stick to the rules. This base here, I actually was hoping to watch this get like defended and attacked, but I was too late to it, and it's being wiped, and it kind of sucks. Now I'm just seeing the aftermath. We're going to have a look at it. Some guys are kind of like checking out to see if they can get any loot out of it. Like They see that there's no turrets at the front anymore, and they want to see if they can like scab some loot. So these two guys have actually rolled up on each other. This uh, this guy with the white tag has no idea this guy's behind him. And that's going to be his mistake. Yeah, that's dead. They die so easy. They're just like a glass behind cannon, basically. He doesn't even know he's <laughs> behind him. <laughs> he doesn't even know he's behind him. He thought it was the turrets that killed him. So he's running. And he is getting smacked up. And he's just All he can do is run. I don't think he has a, a, has a full kit on him. I think he's just trying to get away right now, to be honest. Run. You got him. He's dead. Yeah, so he got bowled, and as soon as you get bowled, if you don't have a shield, you're done. But over at Pat Cave, a cave that I defended until I left on official, it never got wiped. Ever. When I was on in my official tribe. This guy is solely defending right now. His mate's been captured. He's trying to knock him out. He's trying to do what he can to defend with like the limited stock he has. And he's doing the best he can. There's only so much he can do as one single person. He has to try and get those people back so he has more people to defend. He has to make a play. Plays, but he just got whipped off and that, that, that thing's dead. Oh, he's yeah, done. It's, it's bolded now. It's bolded. It's done. GG. He tried. This is when he decided, you know what? I'm making the play. I need somebody to help me. Either if I, I get knocked out or I get my mate back. And that's what he's decided. So he's running up there with a rocket launcher to try and try to freeze, mate. This is his only chance. So he pops a rocket into it. And kills his mate. His mate died. So now he has another person to help defend. The great save. He literally just saved his two caged triad mates. So after that, they tried a little bit longer, but then they gave up because too many people started to defend. He got his guys back and uh, yeah, they, they just gave up. We're heading over, this is Easy Underwater, over on the west coast. And I showed them in the previous video that they were pretty thick. They've gotten thicker. And they are insane right now. Like, look at this. These guys are serious. The amount of effort that's gone into this base in such a short time is insane. The amount of tames they've got so far is crazy. On Ragnarok... This is uh, Highlands Cave. They've changed it so it's a, it's not a crouch, but it's a smaller smaller defense. This is the Lion Cave. It's over at the desert part of Ragnarok. It's looking good. Obviously, this is the desert, another desert cave over in Ragnarok. It's looking all right. And you've got the one that's in like the canyon. These guys are pretty thick. They're actually, kind of compact and nice. But yeah, Ragnarok's looking kind of thick right now. Even over here at the Blue Obby Cave, it's getting thick. Like, yeah. Even rat holes like this. This cheeky little rat hole here, man. These guys are, are trying to survive. What's going on here? Well, that dude's out of here. It's going straight up really fast. That's a bit weird. 
Wait, wait, was it a cheater that came? So this kid thought that this guy, or one of the guys, that one that went up into the sky really quick was a cheater. I said it looked okay at the time, I wrote in chat. Yeah, you get that RG, mate, you get that RG. But then I was suspicious, I'm like, I wonder if he is a cheater, let's follow him for a bit. <laughs> <laughs> and somehow he lets his dino die to ants of all things. And then he goes back to the rat hole to grief this kid. And like, what's he doing? It looks like he's scanning the area. And then straight after that, he decides he wants to go straight to a hidden storage box and find it, destroy it, and make it popcorn everywhere instantly. And that there is a bit sussy. As you'll see. And I'm going to keep this really uncut so that you can uh, kind of see how he just moves to every location. It was starting to make me a bit worried. So... It came from all the way from that cave, went straight to this box. It breaks and all the stuff popcorns as it breaks. So I was like, that's a bit weird. I've never seen that before. I shouldn't do that. And then he boosts super fucking high up in the thing. Boosts forwards and goes straight to this little rat hole right here. And like thinks that he can get straight in here and he's pushing against the wall. He's like, I can see it. But like, what? Why can't I get in there? And now he's K-moding to get in. So he finally goes in there, right? And he, he wants to have a look and everything. So he's, obviously this is a grapple kind of uh, weird rat hole. I think it's okay to build. Some of them aren't if you have to use chairs and dinosaurs to get in. He was just boosting up like crazy. He couldn't even see the jet thing happen. It could be just a glitch. But then he logged out in there for a while. So I left him for a bit. But I came back on the server and I saw he was griefing this kid again. I'm like, I gotta keep watching this guy, like, there's something wrong about him. Like, something makes me feel sus. So, I wanted to catch a cheater, because this kid kept um, saying there was a cheater, there was a cheater, there was a cheater. And I wanted to give him the benefit of the doubt. So, he goes out there and actually tries to fight him, which is like, I give him mad respect, man. He went out there and just popped him some. Gets a C4 shot on him, and the dude was out. I don't know what's with that. I don't know if you guys can explain that with the boost and that. I don't know if that's a sussy thing or not. Oh, it could just be a glitch. So, I don't know. You guys explain that to me. I think it could be normal. I don't know. He's trying to place a C4 trap and hide and stuff. Didn't even look like he punched just then. It looked like he did the leg boost thing, but he could have punched. Who knows? He's got a shield out. Could be a, could be a punch move. But this is where it gets super sus. You watch what happens here. Ready? Runs up. Popcorns instantly. That's a cheat. He's hiding there. And he's like, oh, okay. I just run straight past like I've got tech leggings on. Yep. Past all the turrets. Past all the turrets. Hardly shooting him. And he runs around the base and everything popcorns around him. So this was the perfect proof I needed to report this to the admins. Bro, why? So that's what I did. This, like, I want people to have a positive experience in this game. So this is me explaining to one of the admins and showing proof and putting in a... Too? Oh yeah, that's a cheat. Putting in some proof to see what they think. Yeah, 100%. Which is, which, see how his leggings ran? He ran like a tech legging yeah. just then. They're hardly shooting him. He boosted in, boosted in, goes in. Everything popcorns. Yeah, that's a cheat. That's everything out of this. <laughs> every, every what moment. the heck? Yeah, so he full on cheated. And he died in their base, you can get his implant. So, with that, he popped over there after a while, banned him, and the kid was happy. <laughs> He's taking a photo next to you. <laughs> you want young people to have a positive experience on the game because they're the new generation of people that are actually going to play it. And that's exactly right. You want them to, you know, play <laughs> <don't> legit. Know. <laughs> So after that, I felt proud of myself, so I was going to go watch some uh, some uh, Lava Cave, or what do you call it, Golem Cave PvP. And these people in here are insane. I'm scared to go here when I actually play the server, because people are insane, as you'll see. It's got a long neck. Oh, God. Then, run, boys! Run! Run, 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 run. 
Oh, his, his legs are gone. You need a bet. He's dead. GG. CF United against CF. Oh, that was stupid. So these guys were absolutely destroying him. This guy was dying. I don't know if he fell in there on purpose or if he accidentally fell into the lava. This guy wanted the loot. And after trying for ages, okay. he actually got it. It's not decent, he was just missing it. Good job, dude. You deserve that. Dude, the ultimate escape. Do -do -do. Do -do -do. Do -do -do. Paratroopers are coming in. Air support inbound. What's all that doing? Oh, so, so confused with this guy. He was doing figure eights while his mate was out there defending the, fr the front. Why is he doing figure eights around a f door frame while his mate's out there PvPing? So there must have been a Discord or something, I would think so. And this guy was fine at the front, so he was just doing figure eights. Must have been, you know, where people talk when they're in Discord and they just run around base. That's what I feel like he was doing. Back over at the Lava Golem Cave, and stuff's about to get intense. Two tribes are thinking of doing Lava Golem at once. Can three take on five? Oh, they're waiting, they're waiting. Well, the three guys that are in here first, gonna are they going to win they against know. the five guys to come? They keep throwing it out as they go. These guys are terrified. There's a whole enemy waiting, whole, almost a whole tribe waiting while these guys do the uh, lava golem. It's so funny. They know they're there as well. Both teams know that they're there. Oh, it's about to go down. It's about to go down. Oh, it's almost over, so he's going over to get ready on his rhino. So that when these guys run in, he's going to yeet his delete us some. So the barrier goes down, and this is the time. What's going to happen? You can't net rhinos on here, and I don't think he knew that. He got one. 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 One's run in. He got another one. Uh oh, he's dead. Oh. These guys are stomping these other guys that have just come in. Like, absolutely annihilating them. They are clutching this up right now. Holy! He's dead. Paul is yet dead. <laughs> and winning that 5v3, they get to talk smack. I mean... He just dropped them. We're back over on center right now. And this little base on center in a little cave is getting raided by some other guys that aren't very established. And it's kind of cool to see these little raids. These early game raids are kind of fun to watch because it brings back so many memories. He died. He actually died. He killed him. <laughs> Let's go. Come on, shotgun! Pay attention! Oh, so they're raiding them and they're defending. So don't mind my passionate commentary. <laughs> it's quite quiet in chess piece now. Shoot, 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 shoot! Shoot! Shoot the wyvern! Kill the fucking wyvern! You shotgun the fucking maywing! So I headed over to Fyodor, and I'm at the spider cave, or I think it's a, it's a honey cave as well. I'm not too sure, but I'm pretty sure it's a spider cave. And I found somebody with a familiar name. Mr. Stooby Dooby YouTube. And they're building it right now. Thought I'd pop around for a bit and have a look what he's doing. See what they're doing to their base, how they're building it kind of laugh at him if he stuffs up he you know messes up at any point and then just rub it in his face but he did pretty good and they were just building for the night 
And these guys are taming a Giga using a Mantis to first knock most of it out and then using Trank Darts to finish it off. It's actually intelligent, it makes it so much faster. So if you guys ever want to do it, it's actually a really smart way of doing it. You got to shield up as well because they've just got that much. And then there's the Element Biome on MTS. This is like a haven for PvP. You go there at your own risk because everyone wants Element and everyone wants you not to have Element. Some people just go there to grief for fun, like the Lava Golem. And that's what's happening here. These guys wanted it, the other guys didn't. And, uh, yeah, they're trying to stop them from having it. As you can see, there's already a dead couple dead wyverns there. People have been trying to do some, some, do some plays on them. Not succeeding. What's going to happen here? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, he's dead. He's done. Yeah, he's done. Sorry about the audio delay just then. It's a bit weird. Sometimes it messes up when I do instant replay. This guy here was chasing the guy in the distance. Got hopped off this, sniped him, and this is him. Dead. Because he's got fed on. So back on the center right now. This guy got killed by the whole group just here. They've got the same color names, but I'm pretty sure they're different tribes. So he's going to get his loot. No one had found it. It was hidden in the water. And uh, he's now got it. And he's going to try and escape all these people. He's going to try and get to a drop. Get away with his loot. And then rub it in their face when he gets away. But you know what? The whole swamp wants to kill him. The whole swamp wants him to fail. As PvE does on Ark, it likes to, it likes to get in your way and kill you at the worst opportune time. And then a Capro. He's really not, oh, he's really not having a good day. I hate Capros, I hate Trudons. <laughs> oh no! Everything wanted to kill him. He was having a bad day, but he was making it. He got away though, he got his back and he got away with it. His whole swamp was to kill him. And he made it to a drop. Talk smack in chat saying, thanks to my kid. <laughs> And then left. And those people were triggered. It was actually kind of funny. These guys are in the rat hole that I've talked about a few times in the thing. They're actually taming at Karcha. And uh, guess what happens in between, boys? There's an aerial battle ensuing. I love Tropios. They're just, I don't know, man. They're so memey and fun. And like, it feels like you're in a, in a fighter jet. And you're taking on all these flyers, like Wyverns and Skiffs just hate these things. As you'll see, why? Like the, this guy in the Tropio was just going off. And they're so fast, if you're about to get grabbed, you can just... I think you press C, the C button, and it does like a barrel roll spin backwards and stuff. It stops you from it getting grabbed. So like, you can smack the Skiff up so hard as well. It does a lot of damage to flyers, and I think Skiff is classed as a flyer, possibly. So... Yeah, these guys are just having a little little watch party right now. Like, oh man, we don't want to mess with these guys. Look at this, there's wyverns, there's troppies, there's skiffs. Like, we ain't ready for this. Or they're waiting to get tribed up. That could be a thing as well. The skiff's trying its hardest to pick the troppio, but the troppio knows to avoid the beam. And he's just smacking it up the whole time. Who's going to win though? Will the skiff grab him? Or will the troppio make him retreat? What are you guys wishing? What do you reckon is going to happen? Let's see if you're right. Oh, he's smacking him up. Oh, man. Oh, what the heck? See, he just done the spin, got away. And then he's back after him again. Straight back on it. That would be so infuriating as the as the skiff driver. You just can't do anything. Yeah, he got smacked. Just look, oh, he's on fire. He's done. He needs to get. He needs to retreat. So if you said the guy retreats on the skiff, you're correct. Congratulations. Go on. How many grenades you got, man? Ah, oh, buddy, your dog have legs. 
Well, that ends another raid game. Hope you guys enjoyed. There are some fun things. We got a cheater. We got him gone. And I think this is a successful day.